Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, and yes, from the title, another Warriors game review. And yes, the Warriors win their second road game in a row. We win against the Dallas Mavericks. What a game. Now, as you know, the War I literally just posted a game review of the Rock Warriors winning, snapping their 11-game road losing streak. So, today in this video, before, before we get into it, like and subscribe, you know how we roll. And yes, this is a massive game, so much to talk about. Every Warriors game this season, so much to talk about. But particularly this game, because there's so much on the stake in this game. We win 127 to 125. But before we do any talks about the box score and everything, we will go in and we watch the game recap of the Warriors Mavericks game. Because legit, there is <laughs> legit so much stuff to talk about. Honestly, to talk about. So here we go. Um, if you haven't seen the Rockets game review, go check that out before you watch this because you won't understand anything. So here we go. So Warriors Mavericks at American Airlines Center. You got Luka Doncic returning. He returns after missing like five or six games with a thigh injury, I believe. And there's Steph Curry. Kyrie, though, is not playing. So that's a big plus for us. Look at the score. We're up by 10. And then here goes Luca. Luca driving over Kavon Looney gets the bucket to go. So 13 12. Then Luca driving, floated good, and the Warriors have to call a timeout. So no, sorry. Yeah, Warriors call a timeout. So we're up, we're down not we're down by three here, but then Curry does his work down the stretch. 24 25 now. Dallas, Mavericks, get a bucket from Christian Wood. We're down by three. 32 35. Curry to Looney. This game was back and forth the whole game. I'll tell you. 38-41. Luca step back three. The lead's up to six. And then Kaminga throws it down. Moving on. Curry now. Step back three is on the way. Steph. We're up by one now. 62-61. It would up by two at halftime. So great game on the road. Then Luca guarded by Green. Drives. Gets the bucket plus the foul. They're coming back in this one. The Dallas Mavericks, 86-85. Then Jordan Poole elevates and drops the dunk in. Luca finds Christian Wood. Ack out to Hardy for three as the clock runs down. So it's a one-point game. And then Poole did it to Jermichael Green to end the third on a quick bucket there. What a play there. So we're up by three at the end of the three quarters. But look, this is crunch time. Four-point game makes it a one-point game. We are only... Look, we're up by six now. Hits the bucket. We are up by seven. And then Luca goes in plus the foul. He gets it. So he, the game's tied at 115 or 115. And then Luca dishes it back to Hardy. He gets it in. So they're up by two with 348 to go. Crunch time. 120 all. Curry... Who does he find? Draymond. Yes, plus the foul, Draymond. Look at him. We're up by one. And then Curry with 10 seconds drives it. Mavs call timeout. We are up by three with 8.5. And they give it to Luca. What are the defense here? And Draymond, what a defensive play. And they get the bucket. And the Warriors win a much needed road game. We win by two. Oh my God. So, player of the match, top performers. You've got Jonathan Kaminga drops 22 points. Looney, 12 rebounds. Curry, 13 assists. On the other hand, Luca, 30 points, 7 rebounds, 17 assists for the uh, Dallas Mavericks there. Box score, though. We'll have a look. Clay didn't have a really good night. Anyway, Draymond Green, 14 points, 8 assists, 4 rebounds. Kevon Looney, another double-double. 12 points, 12 rebounds. Curry, 20 points, 13 assists, and 5 rebounds. Nearly had a triple-double. Clay Thompson had a pretty poor night. Nine points, five rebounds, one assist, one from four from three. So not a good night for Clay. DiVincenzo, though, had 14 points off the bench, though. Kaminga drops 22. Jamal Green had nine. Lamb had nine. Jordan Poole, 16. So our bench production's been really good in the last two road games we've had. On the Mavericks side, you got Mark, um, Bullock, 15. Luka Doncic, 30. Uh, Green, 30. 12, Dwight Powell, 13, off the bench, Jaden Hardy, 27, Chris Wood, 19. So, 
Kyrie didn't play, so it was a big plus for us. If Luke and Kyrie played, then this game probably would have gone even closer. But it was a much-needed road game. We definitely need this road game for the tiebreaker. Because the West right now, as you know, is so close. What an absolute game. Play-by-play. Play. We'll go to, like, the you probably saw it, the final four minutes. So this is crunch time. So at the minute 16, Christian Wood. So they're down by one now. So it's 123 to 122. And then Curry makes a two-foot shot with 8.1 to get us up by three. And then Looney hits two free throws. And at the end of the game, though, Reggie Bullock hits a three with 0.1 left. But that was too late for the time. So we get a much-needed road game. Team stats, 30% from three. Offensive rebounds, 11. Defense rebounds, so three. Beat them in rebounds. Beat them in assists. Beat them in blocks. Beat them in turnovers, which is shocking. Beat them in points off turnovers. Fast break points, beat them. Points and paint, beat them. Fouls. That we got a tech foul. Didn't we got a tech foul? For who? Our largest lead was nine, theirs was eight. So the game was really close through the whole game. First, second, and third and fourth quarter. Was so close. But in the end, we get a dub. So really, this game was amazing. And where the West is right now, as we just saw, the West is so close. So the Warriors end their five-game road trip. They ended on a two and three record. So would have loved to got an Atlanta win. That Memphis game was really the game that really uh, annoyed us. But we knew coming in the, against Rockets, we'd get a victory. And we knew Dallas would be a tough game. But the Warriors grind out. So we on a two-game road winning streak after a 11-road losing streak. So now our record's improved up to 9-29 and 29 on the road. So it's still pretty bad. But if we can get to the double-digit road victories, we're somewhere in the West now. But if we're talking about West, if we go to the standings, this is what we're at here. So we don't want to worry, worry over the West. So we're sitting sixth position, 38-36 record. So two games above 500. We're 11.5 games away from first. So I don't think we're gonna we're not gonna get first. We could get fourth or fifth, or even third. You could say, but uh, we're not really. So we can we really only get our best chance is fourth, fourth or fifth. We could get even sixth. But we're two games above 500, which means two games above the playing tournament. So we are really in a great position. After If we lost that Dallas game, we would have been back down to 500. So we really needed that game, and we got it. So it was an amazing game we played. So, But the Thunder, look at the Thunder, sitting in a playing spot. The Thunder can make the playoffs. If we go just now to focus on the Warriors in particular, not the whole NBA, we got a four-game homestand coming up. Four games at home, and you know how good we're at home. 20 nine and seven at home we have four games at home first against on saturday against the 76ers and then we've got timberwolves pelicans and then spurs and after that a game on the road against nuggets and then a game back at home to finish off the home uh, um, record and home games for the season against thunder and then two away games at kings and at trailblazers so we've got a four game homestand coming in starts on saturday so we know how good we are at home, but can we get the victories? If we can win all our home games, just say we do, because we're amazing at home, unbelievable at home. Particularly, we are versing the third place 76ers team, so we'd love to get a victory. If we can beat the 76ers and beat all the other games that we're playing at home, we will be 39, 40, 41, 42. We'll be 42 and 36 record. That's a 42 and 36 record. That is a lot of games above 500. Plus, if you think the next road game we've got, which is the Nuggets game, we know how good the Nuggets are. They beat us multiple times. That's going to be pretty tough. Can we get it done? If let's say we lose that Nuggets game, then we come back home play the play the Thunder. We get a victory there. So now our record's up to forty three and thirty seven, and then we got two away games at Kings and at Trailblazers. So Kings is. Going to be a tight game. Trailblazers is going to be a pretty... Should be an easy game. So if you look at the Warriors, if you're a Warriors fan like me and you're looking at the standings and looking at our games coming up, if we can win all four of our home games, you could say we're in the playoffs. So we just got to lock in it. We got we have really four, five, six, seven. We have eight games till the end of the season. So we have to at least win positive four. We've got to win four or more or even five or more of our games left. But I'm looking forward to the end of the season. This Western Conference is stacked. So close. Every team is so close in the Western Conference. Look at that. So we really got to lock in. Steph 
all the front office, the coaches, the players are going to lock him. But the Warriors still haven't played with Gary Payton II or Andrew Wiggins. So once we get GP2 back with the defense and Andrew Wiggins, playoffs are 100%. I'm probably going to predict now that the Warriors will probably finish fifth or sixth. I don't think we might. We might get fourth, but I know we're going to make the playoffs. I believe in hope we'll make the playoffs. But we would either make fifth or sixth, I reckon. Or we could make fourth. I reckon we'll make fourth. But fourth, fifth, or sixth is what I believe we will finish. Finish third last year. Can we finish in a playoff spot? We shall see. Anyway, that's all this video is. What an absolute game the Warriors played. Beating Dallas on the road. How shocking we are. We win back-to-back -back road games after 11-game losing streak. We win the series 2-1. We win by two. So, thanks, guys. Um, I will catch you guys in the next video. Don't know a bit. It might be an update video. It might be another game review. <laughs> we shall see. Might be the 76ers game. Might not. We shall see. Stay tuned. Community posts, YouTube shorts. You know how I roll. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and until next time, enjoy life and have fun. Peace.